Hello friends welcome here. First it was Ezra Miller who got into trouble in Hawaii and now it's Barry Kogan, the actor you played Joker in Robert Pattinson's The Batman. Barry Kogan was arrested for being drunk in public in Ireland's city Dublin. According to the source, Kogan was apprehended by Gardy, the Irish police force on the morning of April 10. The source said, Gardy were called to the apartments after getting reports of a man on a balcony in an intoxicated state. When they arrived he wasn't threatening in any way but was arrested and brought to the Gardaí station, where he was dealt with before being released. The matter is finalized and nothing more will come of it. Kogan was apprehended and taken to Kulak Gardaí station by police before being released without charge. A Garda spokeswoman informed Independent that Gardaí detained a guy in his 20s for a public order incident that happened in Klongriffen at around 6.45 am on Sunday 10 April 2022. He was later freed without charge and given a fixed charge notice. Kogan recently starred as the Joker in Warner Brothers and DC films The Batman. He previously appeared in Marvel Studios' Eternals in 2021. Kogan's participation in The Batman was announced as early as 2020, however it was revealed that he would play Stanley Merkel, a Gotham City Police Department officer. Rumors arose before the film's release that the Eternals star will appear as the Joker in the next DC movie, but only in a little appearance. Although Kogan's Joker cameo was cut from the theatrical release of The Batman, his voice was used in an end credits sequence with Paul Dano's Riddler, for which the Eternals actor was billed as Unseen Arkham Prisoner. Director Matt Reeves later released a five-minute deleted clip featuring Robert Pattinson's Batman and a complete glimpse at Kogan's scarred proto-Joker. Because of the incident's modest nature, it is doubtful that Kogan's career or connection with Marvel or DC would be harmed. While Miller's disturbing behavior apparently prompted DC executives to convene an emergency meeting to discuss the actor's future as The Flash, no such meeting has been convened in the case of Kogan. Although a sequel to The Batman has yet to be formally approved, many people believe it is a foregone conclusion owing to the success of the original picture. It's unclear whether Kogan will repeat his role as the Joker in future films, but The Batman implies that Kogan's clown prince of crime might play a key part in the franchise. Please like this video and subscribe to my channel. See you soon.